Well, good morning, good night, good day, whatever. Anyways, hey, welcome to the show. How you doing, Haley? I'm hot. <sighs> I'm doing great. That's what we wanted to hear. Where are we headed? To go see Captain Marvel. So you know what that means? This is gonna be another Dean and Haley movie review. And what better movie to review? But before we get to that, Haley, start the show. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Now with that out of the way, as a dad, what would be a better movie to take your daughter to than something like Captain Marvel? It's about a superhero woman. As a dad of a daughter, I mean, come on, really? Why wouldn't you want to take your daughter to see something where a woman, a strong woman, is just kicking butt and taking names? I've never had a stop Every now and then the fire truck does come out. <laughs> I know, we've had it stopped for me at least once. Yeah, we, we flashed back to that on the channel at least Ooh. once. Are you excited about seeing this movie? Honestly? Or like... No, no, lie. Go ahead. No. no yes. <laughs> Not really. No? No. I just, uh... If it's like Wonder Woman, I'm gonna be mad. So you were like one of the only women that didn't like Wonder Woman. I have taste? I don't know. But I mean, okay. <laughs> back to Woman Wonder Woman real quick. Was it the plot or just you hated all the slow motion action? I don't really remember the plot. Because you were just too annoyed with the slow yes, motion action? that was just like, ugh, why? Yeah. I want to see things back. It doesn't yeah. seem cool when it's so slow. Does it scare you at all that this is like a retro movie? This is going to happen back in the 90s? That's how Wonder Woman was. Well, hers was way in like, this is World War II. This is the 90s. This is when I grew up. The 90s? Yes, yeah, when I grew up. I was born in the 90s. 99. Still 90. I know. Why would that scare me? I don't know. I don't even know what this movie is about. <laughs> At least you're up on current things. All right. Well, we're driving the movie theater now. We have a five o'clock showing. It's a beautiful Sunday as usual. Do you feel that? Why does my car do that? Because it down idles. It's kind of scary. No, it's normal. It's scary. Okay. I think my car is just... Possessed? Yeah. No, it's just because it's idling low. It's okay. If you rub up the engine a little bit, it'll stop. I didn't say take your foot off the brake, it but... It stopped. Okay. No, it didn't. No, I was just saying, no, it didn't. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Let's get to the mall. Ow. That's the one? Yeah, that's the one. You mean the one with Rock and Jason Hob Statham? Hobbs and Shaw. There you go. August that's 2nd, guys. August 2nd. So that's the big movie? That's going to be the big movie. Okay. What? What'd you think? Oh, oh can they, they stop sending me emails now? That's not the same one. You sure? Mm -hmm. I don't know. But anyways, let's get to the car and we'll talk all about it. I'm going to warn you right now, if you haven't seen the movie, don't watch it from this point forward. Because there will be spoilers. There will be spoilers, people. Come on. Alright, so first impressions, what did you think of the movie? It was better than Wonder Woman. Okay, so that's a high note there. Did you like the Carol Danvers character? Did you like you her? You could just say Captain Marvel. Did you like Captain Marvel? Yeah. Well, okay. <laughs> At first, I didn't like her. Start. I thought she was kind of a bad actor. All right. Did you realize she was just playing a stiff character? No, I just thought she couldn't act. Oh, okay. <laughs> what made you think that she could finally act? I mean, I never really got there. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. So what did you think of the cat? Oh, I wish I kind of had the cat. Yeah? Well, because it was nice. All right, so you got a little confused throughout the movie because the blue guy that came back was from Guardians of the Galaxy. No, I wasn't confused. Okay. Because in Publix, well, who did you say that he was going to turn into? Which one? Hawkeye. Oh, he's not in this movie yet, though. I know. Just oh, tell yeah, me. yeah, he's uh, Ronan. So that's who he's going to turn no, into? No, 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 Those are two totally... But I, it's I don't... the same person. No. That was his name. No, yeah, I know, but I got the name wrong. See, that's why I was confused. See, there you go. Okay, so that wasn't very helpful. All right, so let's talk about, did you think the movie was funny? Yeah. Did you like the Samuel L. Jackson character? Yeah. Wasn't that kind of creepy how they made him younger? I, did, I was going 
gonna ask you how you think they do that. Oh no, Disney spends a fortune on that technology. They actually, oh, so he's computer like generated, him. younger. It's not makeup. Interesting. Yeah, I know, right? Pretty freaky, because he looked good. He looked like young Samuel Jackson yeah. from the movies. It's a little scary. It was a lot scary. I like the green people. The green people, you know, it's funny though, because like the green people are supposed to be the bad guys. Like there's a whole Marvel arc where like- Well, sometimes you just need to change history. I guess, because like there's a whole thing where um, they all turn into Deadpools and Deadpool wipes them all out because his cancer. They don't, they didn't realize. Well, I like them. Yeah, they were good. The guy that played the head, the head scroll was was pretty funny, or however yeah. you pronounce it. Yeah, he was good. I liked her friend. Their friend was cool. The daughter was cute, neat. Cute. Uh, yeah, yeah, no, don't suck. Just in case you were worried. Yes. Captain Marvel will be back in the Avengers. Yeah, she will be back in the Avengers. Shocking. So if you stay like, for the what after. What does that even mean? So if you stay for the after scene. If you see the after scene, she's in the scene. Yeah, that's true. Well, if you've seen like, the movie, because if you're watching it, you've already seen the movie. So I mean, it's like they just like made the Super Bowl ad longer, you know, because that scene was in the Super Bowl ad, and it's just like they cut it, and then it's like for the ad, and then they just added it in, and it was like, hey, and here's what happens. Yeah. Because in, in the Super Bowl ad, they make it look like Ant-Man was the whole conversation. Oh, you're actually there. talking about a real Super Bowl ad? Yeah, that was the Super Bowl ad. Oh, I don't remember that. That's okay. That's Probably okay. Probably fell asleep. Probably fell asleep. It was a wonderful Super Bowl. I thought Bowl. you were just trying to make an analogy. No, that was the actual <laughs> I don't make analogies. I suck at that. Exactly. So I wasn't really <laughs> sure. <laughs> you know what you should do on your vacation? What vacation? Yeah, you know, spring break. Uh, you should watch Rick and Morty so you can get it when I go pickle Rick. All right, guys. I know well, who pickle Rick is. Yeah, Rick from Rick and Morty. Yeah. So why do I need to watch? Because it? it's funny watching him be a pickle. Oh crap! This is how I'm gonna die. Anyways, I don't know. We're not real good at these review things. We're working on it. You know what we forgot to do? Our Siskel and Ebert. Two thumbs up, two thumbs down, one up, one down. Would you recommend the movie? I would recommend it. So, two thumbs up? What was the last one that we did? Predator. Oh. It's been a while. I didn't, I couldn't remember if we reviewed Wonder Woman. No, that was a long Way before. better than Wonder Woman. We took Woman. Papa That's Joe all, to see Wonder Woman. Yeah, and even he fell asleep. I liked Wonder Woman. No, that was so. Alright, well, let me ask you this. Do you feel she was a strong female character? Yeah. So, Wait. Can what, you rephrase that? Do you feel like she was a strong female character? So, for example, when I was a young boy and I watched like Indiana Jones, mm -hmm. I wanted to be Indiana Jones. So I went home and you know I ran around. Yeah, I think she's a good example for young. So like children. if you were a, a young girl, instead of going to see, I a would want to be her. Yeah. Not Wonder Woman. Okay. Cool. Except I changed my hair because that mohawk is just not doing it for me. Well, you saw how they all had mohawks though, right? No. All the, men, the men had the mohawks up the center. Okay, but the girl, the blue girl, didn't have a mohawk. She was a blue girl though, man. I'm just yeah. Saying. So the big, the big complaint going into this movie was the hair. It's so ugly. So you being a sports person and it's funny every girl on the soccer field has a ponytail not by choice no you do it because the hair gets in your face yes which is always i find funny because like when we see the girls outside of soccer and they all have their hair downs i have no idea who they are i've never seen them yeah. without ponytails her biggest complaint was it even happened in the movie like i wasn't wrong no the hair was always getting in her face it was like why it would she, just like, why would she not have a ponytail and i just loved how her hair came down from the hawk and it was perfectly fine but she does have superpowers and now we know why he has an eye patch damn oh, cat yeah but i just don't understand why it just <laughs> randomly scratches him in the eye you never trust things cats i know Can't animals kind of scare me know what they're thinking it's like kind of scary i thought the movie was hilarious i'm giving it two thumbs up you giving it two thumbs up yeah all right sure. <laughs> so i guess that's the important takeaway from this that if you haven't seen it and you were silly enough to keep watching because you're like hey they might give me spoilers yeah okay so we did a crappy job with that but i would go see it I would definitely go see it for sure. Definitely gonna wanna see it before the Avengers comes out because you kinda gotta figure out who she is. All right, we're gonna end it on that. End the show, Haley. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you guys so much for sticking with us and hanging out with us in the boring life. I'm hungry. Of course, we had no food in this video. What was I thinking? Not even popcorn. Oh my gosh. Have a good night, guys. We'll see you later. Bye.